Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, we're gonna be doing something super awesome. But before I get started, subscribe to my channel, give me a big thumbs up. Let's do this. So, as you guys probably know, Squid Games is super popular right now. And in Squid Games, there's a ton of different games, like Red Light, Green Light, a Jump on Glass, and a Honeycomb Cookie Game. So today, we're gonna be doing that Honeycomb Cookie Game. But first, we're gonna make the cookies put the shapes in them, and then I'm also going to invite my family and see who's the best at honeycomb cookie breaking. I don't know what to call it, but they break shapes out of the honeycomb cookie, and I'll see who's best, and the winner gets $1,000. All right, from what I've seen, making this cookie is actually really easy. All you need is a pan, some baking soda, and sugar. That's all you need. So, I think it'll work. We'll try, and do our best. Hopefully it works. All right, we're about to make the cookies. All we need is some sugar and some baking soda, I guess. I mean, I feel like you would need more, but this is, this is what they say we need. We need a decent amount of sugar and just barely any baking soda and we'll create this cookie. So let's open the sugar. Also, one of the biggest things that it says is it has to be on like medium to low heat. It can't be like super hot. Turn that to medium real quick. All right, first we need three tablespoons of sugar. That's one, right there. Now you stir this until it becomes liquid. Just break this into little small pieces. And we keep stirring until it becomes liquid like this. All right, this part's important. So we're gonna chop the heat. All right, the heat's off. We're gonna put in an eighth of baking soda. I almost said that wrong. Put it in, and as soon as you get it in, you gotta start mixing again. Oh, uh oh, it's solid egg. It's changed uh, to a light brown. It looks like the color of the actual cookies. Now, so I think we're doing good. Let's pour it out. Oh my. It's beautiful, isn't it? Oh, I really hope we did this right. It looked a little bit different in that guy's video. It looked a little bit lighter, but it looks okay, I think. Let's try to get all of us off as much as we can. Uh oh. Or attempt number one doesn't seem to be going very great. It's kind of stuck to the shape thing. And so we're just kind of waiting for it to dry out all the way so we can maybe get the circle out of it. And hopefully it'll work. After a while, solid, it became a little more solid and it worked. It doesn't look the prettiest. It's still a little hot, but it worked. And that's what matters. It's fine, it's fine. I put it down and it broke. It's fine, it's still part of the shape. All right, I am no longer allowed to touch the cookies after I have broken multiple, so. Jared's over here doing the mixing part. Sugar. I've, I've got the baking powder and everything ready for him. So how's it going? You cannot, just don't even touch anything. You, you can put the shapes in. You can put the shapes. I can put the shapes in. Let's That's go. about it, though. Can I take the shapes out, or is that just in? No. <laughs> no, I can only put them in. You can put them in, you cannot take them out. That is fair. All right, with the shapes, we have the circle right here, which is what we're gonna do here. We're gonna put a square in. We have this strange circle shape, but it has like, I don't know what to call them, like spikes almost sticking out the sides. We've got the shape of a house, a shovel, and kind of like a flower. I feel like this circle with like the spike things on it is going to be the hardest for whoever ends up actually doing this one. While like the circle and maybe the square are gonna be the easiest. So, yeah, hopefully, uh, oh, we got our second cookie coming in. Oh, this one looks way better than the, <laughs> than the other one. Put the shapes in. All right, through trial and error, mostly just a ton of error, 
on our 5,000th time remelting and creating these cookies, we have our final results. Yes, they may be almost completely black, but we made the cookies. They're not gonna taste great, they don't look great, but they're done. All right, so the way this game will work is we have, we all have one pin. And using this pin, we have to try to poke out the shapes on each of the cookies. And if you break the shape inside the cookie, then you're out, you lose. And if you can get the shape out of the cookie, that's the person that wants to thousand dollars. All right, we got the shapes in our tins so that when my family chooses which one's which, they don't know what they are because some of them are obviously gonna be harder than the other ones, like the spike one in the house are a little bit harder than the square in the circle. But we're gonna go and we're gonna see who is the best Squid Games player cutting out these honeycomb cookies that um, look very great right now. All right, let's see who's gonna win this $1,000. Let's go. All right, Taylor is going to be our first contestant. Wait, where am I? Taylor, do you want to play a game? Yes. Yeah, yeah, you do. <laughs> All right, this game, you have a chance of winning $1,000, but if you fail, you get a punishment. What's the punishment? Okay, no. All right, Taylor, inside of each of these tins is a cookie with a different shape in it, all right? All you will have is a needle. And you're gonna have to cut out the shape using that needle without breaking the cookie. If you can do that in under two minutes, you win $1,000. But if you can't, you get a punishment. Choose your tin wisely. This one. All right, Taylor, open up your shape. Oh. oh. That is a hard one. That one's probably, I want to say that one's probably the hardest one of them all. All right, grab your pin out. All right, two minutes of the clock, starting now. <laughs> okay. Um. See your punishment. <laughs> Taylor, your punishment is the polar plunge. You are eliminated. Eliminated. Where am I? Hello, Peyton. Are you ready? Inside this tin, you have a cookie and a pin. And you break out the shape without it breaking, and you win. You have two minutes to break out the shape. Good luck. Don't break it before you even start. Oh, you got a house. A house? That one would probably be very hard for you to do. Okay. Oh, you're going for a very strange strip. Oh my gosh, it didn't break. <gasps> I'm surprised it's not broken. Just kidding. Oh. Have to do it. Squeeze the middle piece hard. No. Oh my gosh. <sighs> Easy. I don't, I don't even know what to say. Done. House arrow, whatever it is, done. I'm actually impressed. Wait, is that your name, what? I yeah. won! Yes! 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 I... Yes! Does it still count? It looks to me like it's broken. But it, it was perfect! I just accidentally switched it. Hey, then. You broke the cookie. You must receive a punishment. All of it. All of it. 
It's just lemon juice. That's lemon juice. And you are eliminated. Yes, yes. Yes. Welcome to Squid Games. You will have two full minutes. Oh, easy. To not break the cookie. Wait, what? It was two minutes to not break the cookie. But it's a cookie. Well, you get a punishment, so. <laughs> I guess I uh, should have said 200. On to the next contestant. Hey, wait, don't you owe me a hundred bucks? That's what I thought. You are the last contestant. If you can break out the shape out of the cookie without breaking it, you will win the $1,000. Go right ahead. Okay. You got the square. All right, I can do this. Your two minutes start now. Careful. Ow. Come on. Oh, okay. You've got two sides off and you're halfway there. One minute left. Three sides are off with 50 seconds remaining. You have 20 seconds left. Fifteen. Five. I did it! You are the winner! Congratulations! Yeah! Well, my mom was the only one able to break it right, so for an extra prize, you get to an eat the cookie. An extra prize? You get to eat the cookie. It's That's delicious, it's honeycomb, lots of sugar, lots of sugar. It doesn't smell that good. <laughs> Wait, why can't you break it? Oh yeah. Uh, oh. <laughs> While she's doing that, I guess that's the end of today's video, so make sure to subscribe and give a thumbs up, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.